today i am going to show how to make engine shaft in solid works so let's begin i first click here double click on part this one is taking some time okay now change the unit here our unit is IPS, change it to MMGS, now go to sketch, click on sketch again and from this planes select front plane, now select line, now draw line, Continue drawing lines. Okay. Continue drawing lines. Now this time to close. Okay. Now we need to put the measurement. Go to smart dimension. Take this one 10. That means 10 millimeter. But 110 mm. <coughs> now this one is also 10 mm. This one is 1 mm, this one 32 mm, 32, this one will be 2 mm, then this one 52 mm, after that this one will be 3 mm and this one is 59 mm now make this one just 9 mm now make this one 12 mm Now I need to change some direction here. Okay. Now click here. Okay. Uh, click on space, skip. Okay. Now select here and bring in this side. Also select here and bring in this side. Okay. Select smart dimension again. Take this one, okay, not that. Okay, skip my dimension. Take this one 7.5 mm. Now this one is 24 mm. After that, this one is 9 mm. And then this one is the last one 18 mm 18 millimeter now our drawing is fully defined
okay now go to features select revolved boss or base now axis of revolution click here and select this line okay this is our engine shaft now we need to make some modification here we need some modification now for modification just uh, select okay select right plane space bar click here okay what exactly this one okay we'll draw this one I'll go to sketch okay from here I select center point straight slot okay uh, select this one first okay select right plane sketch select this line and click on convert entities now select this line and select construction geometry okay now from here select center point straight slot okay okay now smart dimension take this dimension 8 mm and this dimension 35 mm now select this center point okay and click press press control and select this center point okay 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 skip now select this center point press control now select this center point okay our actual our smart dimension is selected skip this one now select the center point of this line press on control select center point of this line and make them horizontal okay now check this one this at the middle point now go to features select extruded cut and from this option select surface now select this surface and this one select 3.5 mm okay now this portion is completed I can select right plane, sketch, press on space bar, click here, select this line, click convert entities, this line has been converted, now select this line again and make it construction geometry, again select center point straight slot. Draw slot here. Okay, go to smart dimension and keep this distance 8 mm. And this one is 10 mm. Okay, now select this center point, press on control and select this center point and make them horizontal. Okay, it is in the middle point. Now go to features, select extruded cut again from surface. Now select here and select this surface. 
now make this one 10 mm okay again select right plane click on sketch click on space bar click here now select circle draw a circle here okay smart dimension and take the dimension 5 mm okay select this line click on convert entities now i can select this line make it for construction geometry now select the midpoint of this line and midpoint of the circle and make them horizontal okay again it is also in the middle point now go to features select suited cut from here select so all both okay now our shaft is ready now apply the material edit material you can select uh, your steel according to your reference according to your uh, preference now i'm selecting aisi304 apply close now edit appearance Okay, apply this one. Now edit the color. Okay, this color. Okay, now our shaft is complete. So, friends, if you think this video is useful, please subscribe my channel, like, comment, and share my videos. And if you have any question regarding this video, this tutorial, SolidWorks or AutoCAD, you can ask that in the comment box. Thank you.